Mahilig ako sa... Sa mal... <laughs> What's up, Ride Maxers and Mams, and welcome to Team Ride Max Philippines TV. My name is Topi Tiana, your host, and again, welcome to our channel. We're here to show you anything and everything all about the car culture so that you guys can understand things and of course so that you guys can also make a much more informed decision. So do stick around and our channel is here to promote inclusivity in the Philippine car culture. Ay, wait. Sino kaya to? Mukhang may surprise guest at ako makakasama ngayon ah. Sino kaya siya? Tara, tingnan natin. Uy! Ito na nga! We are blessed to be in the presence of one of a, our very own beautiful brand ambassadors or better yet known as a Ride Max babe. Say hello to Miss Hot Import Nights 8 Manila, Miss Trisha Kaluma. Hi, Topi, and hello everyone. I'm Trisha, and I've been a part of the Ride Max Babe since 2019. I'm happy to have been choosing to represent XD Series Wheels. So, Trisha, ready mo na malaman kung ano ang pinapangita natin dito sa XD Wheels at sa KMC Wheels? Yes, let's go! Tara! So for this vlog, we're going to be talking about the big guns whenever it comes to American aftermarket wheels. From Wheel Pros, we're talking about the XD Series by KMC Wheels, where action meets style like no other. KMC is redefining performance on and off the asphalt since the early 90s with innovating styles and relentless pursuit to confront possibility. KMC wheels are designed for the rule-breaking, game-changing individuals who defy conventional thinking in motorsports and use machines to pull off the impossible. Based in Denver, Colorado, Wheel Pros is a leading designer, marketer, and distributor of branded aftermarket wheels. Back in the early 2000s, chrome wheels were all over the place. You remember it from all the TV shows you would see from Hit My Ride, even from popular culture icons like Eminem, Ice Cube, and many, many more. You can see they have these big, big SUVs with all these chrome wheels, and it was something that you enjoyed growing up. However, XG Series does bring it to an entirely different level. How? Or, paano nga ba? Well, they got this five-spoke badass rock star design as you can see right here which propelled it to US stardom that everybody can enjoy in the wheels industry and the rest as they say is history definitely something beautiful and that's something that everybody enjoys here in the Philippines XD wheels started back in 2003 and they've been here for the past 17 years and they are now up to 200 designs wow so whenever we talk about XD wheels you gotta remember it has three characteristics Lightweight, strong quality, and race-tested. Its wheels thrive on the dirt and chaos of extra-duty off-road racing. They are built for those who need precise equipment for an imprecise environment. XD wheels are always looking for the next challenge. So perfect talaga siya sa mga gusto pagandahin ang kanilang auto and for off-road enthusiasts that use their rigs for relief and rescue operations and recreational purposes such as going on trail adventures. So Trish, pag narinig mo ang uh, salitang gulo, okay, anong unang-unang dumarating sa isip mo? Um, yung rim. Kasi ayun yung parang nagpapaganda ng sasakyan eh. Hmm, tama. Now, sa lahat ng mga gulong na to, ano yung pinaka-paborito mo sa kanilang lahat? I think ito. Ito? Yeah. Bakit? Parang ang cool niya kasi pag nilagay siya sa sasakyan, parang ang ganda lang kasi ako mahilig ako sa... 4x4 four, four, four four na mga sasakyan. Mm, sa mga malaki yung sasakyan? Yeah. Sa malaki? <laughs> okay. Ayun, parang ang cool lang kasi pag nilagyan mo siya ng ganito and may mga design siya. Tama nga naman. Okay, and you know, that's the way with wheels, you know. Wheels complete the image of the car, whichever and whatever you buy. Speaking of wheels though and speaking of car, there, there's gonna be another segment that we are now gonna be offering for you. This is called Topi Tips. Now, Topi Tips are very, very simple tips that I will be offering for you at this channel to let you know more about your car. Topi Tip number one is gonna be knowing your car or how to know your wheel. 
Now remember that there are basic things that you have to remember every time you do buy a wheel. One by one, I'm gonna be showing it to you right here, right now. The first thing we have for you is the spokes. These are the spokes. These are the spokes that we have for you. Spokes are integral to the image of a car's rim. Okay. Now, siempre iba iba ang mga design nito. Merong spokes na medyo malapad. Meron mga spokes na manipis. Depende sa inyong gusto. Okay. Now, aside from spokes, though, you also have other things that are important to your car, like the lug holes. What are lug holes? Lug holes, or in other countries, alams they are they are known as lug nuts. Lug nuts are the screws you place in between these uh, these wheels. You you can see them right here because this wheel has a difference compared to this wheel. This wheel kasi yung center cap niya mas kita so to speak or mas maliit siya. So kita mo agad yung uh, yung lug nuts whenever you put them in the lug holes. Dito siya papasok. Now kapag dito naman ang center cap tinatakpan niya yung lug nuts. So, siyempre, kailangan mo, kailangan mo siyang buksan bago mo ma, ma, matanggal ang inyong mga lug nuts. So, depende, depende naman yan. Speaking of which, again, we're gonna go back to the center cap. Center cap is the item you see in the middle. Now, the center cap, it has the complete logo of what we have for you. And aside from that though, these center caps, they do change. Paiba-iba siya. Depende sa design. May center cap na malaki, may center cap din na maliit. So, it's entirely up to what design you buy. Last but not the least though, you also have the valve stem hole. Now the valve stem hole is this particular item here. It's very important because this is the passageway of the air to get into the tire. You have to make sure that this particular part is accessible to your tire as much as possible. And of course, lastly, you have the lip. The lip is the item, all right? The, or the rim lip, as they say, is the item which protrudes or which is, goes over or under your tire depending on your design. Topi tip number two. To know what your offsets are, which is which, and what are the sizes. Topi, ano ba meron mga sizes na meron dito sa Pilipinas? Actually, yung mga sizes we have for you, iba-iba yan. Okay? So, meron tayong 17 by 9, meron tayong 20 by 9, and meron tayong mga 20 by 10, and many, many more. We're here to show you what we have for you. The first number you always remember, like let's say, example natin is 17 by 9, like what we have here. Kapag 17 by 9, the first number is 17. That's your uh, diameter, okay? 17 inches to. All right, this is 17 inches from this side to this side. 9 inches would be your width. So that would be your second number. Your width would be this front part all the way to the back part. That's very important because you need to make sure that your tire matches the rims properly, okay? And lastly, whenever you see a positive or a negative number, that's the offset. Offset is very, very important because offsets do show how your car stands in relative to your tires. So there's a positive offset, there's a negative offset, and there is a zero offset. Now, whenever we talk about wheel offsets, I did mention earlier we have the positive, the negative, and the zero offset. One by one, I'm going to be showing it to you what they all exactly mean. So, negative offset. Ito yung mga para sa mga aggressive na sasakyan, alright? Yung mga what do you call it? Mga off-road rigs na nakalabas ang gulong. Okay, so the wheels protrude a little bit more. Okay, it do stick out compared to the body. Zero offset naman is the stuff you see in the uh, zero offset is the stuff you see in the in your regular cars. Pantayong sasakyan to the bodywork or pantayong bodywork to the tire. And lastly, we have the positive offset. Positive offset is the tire going inside compared to the car. So again, those are the three we have for you. So, Topi, ano kaya mga mags na bagay sa mga sasakyan? Well, ang mga mags naman ng bawat sasakyan, iba-iba yan. Depende yan sa PCD ng bawat kotse. Ano ba ang PCD? PCD is simply called Pitch Circle Diameter. How do I properly explain this? Ang Pitch Circle Diameter, basically, yan ang dami ng inyong mga butas dito sa inyong mga lug holes kung saan mo ilalagay ang mga lug nuts. That's one part. The other part is yung diameter. How far it is from one side to the other, okay? Kasi sometimes, whenever you hear pitch circle diameter, nagbabago yan based on the numbers eh. Meron 6 by 139.7, and sometimes you hear it. Confusing na naman. So it's another set of numbers to figure out. What's the 6? Kunwari, ito. 6 by, uh, by 139.7, as I mentioned earlier, okay? 6 holes. Yung 139.7 would be the distance from one hole to the other side 
diagonally. Okay? Not beside each other, pero diagonally. So, syempre, this is very, very important because yung PCD, nagbabago siya sa bawat sasakyan na binibili mo. Okay? Because remember that the PCD is integral because it is a part of the, uh, of the axle of the car which basically makes sure that your wheels properly fit into that vehicle. So, PCD. Meron tayong 6x139.7. This is used for universal pickup trucks and SUVs like uh, the Ford Everest, the Ford Ranger, Raptor, Toyota Hilux Conquest, Toyota Fortuner, Mitsubishi Strada, Chevrolet Colorado, Isuzu D-Max, Isuzu MUX, and many, many more. Another PCD you want to look at is the 6x114.3, also used for the Nissan Navara and the Nissan Terra. Another PCD to look at is the 5x127. This is for the Jeep automobiles, the Jeep Wrangler, Jeep Rubicon, and many, many more, all under the Jeep brand. Lastly, we have the 5x139 for smaller cars, like the Suzuki Jimny, which is a perfect car to take for you to go around the city or even go off-roading. Dopey tip number three, trying to figure out which matches your rig. Dopey? bagay dito sa mga sasakyan? Parang tayo, bagay. Well, maraming ang mga bagay na bagay sa isa't isa. Unang-una, we have our first tire here. This is known as the XD851 Monster 3 with a matte black or gray tint finish which you guys could surely enjoy. Kitang-kita mga, mga naman, Trisha. Very macho look na siya. Bagay sa sasakyan, kung mahilig ka sa off-roading, kung mahilig ka sa malaki, kung mahilig ka sa muscular, depende sa'yo, this would be the wheel for you. Now, if you want something a little bit sportier, I'm also inviting you to take a look at our second design. The second design is known as the KM542 Impact. It's got a matte black finish and as you can see, mas marami siya mga spokes, mas manipis. And at dahil mas manipis siya, it has a more sportier approach to it. At as you can see, yung lip, mas mataas din siya. At dahil mas mataas yung lip, ito nga, medyo nagmumuka siyang sportier. Alright? And it looks a little more faster, so to speak. And bagay na bagay nga naman if you want something different from our first design earlier. This is our third design. This is the XD840 Spy 2. With a perfect matte black and uh, dark tint design. Okay, now it's got the big, uh, it's got the big spokes, but it's also got the proper lip to it. So it's somewhere in the middle of muscular and sporty, perfect for your cars. Our fourth design here in the house right now is the XD Addict 2. And it's got the matte black finish with again, all of our traditional uh, spokes right here. And it's true to the XD image, as you can see. And as you can remember, XD was one of the pioneers on matte black designs. Another design you want to see is the XD137 FMJ. Topi, para saan tong mga to? Ito yung mga double simulated beadlocks. Now, double simulated beadlocks, as you can see, this is one, this is two, and that gives it a double approach. The double approach does uh, give it a more masculine approach whenever you use these tires, and especially when you mix it, or when you, when you put it on properly, on your wheels, or on your car. All right, and of course, our third design for the house is the KM544 Mesa. And again, it's got all the, uh, the sporty looking spokes. It's complete. But as you can see, it's glossy here on the outside. But somewhere in the middle, dito sa gitna, it has the complete matte black finish. So it's the best of both worlds. May konti kang glossy, may konti ka rin black, at bagay na bagay siya kapag magkasama. The next design we have for you is the XD Haas 2. The matte black and the gray tint with you, all right, the complete design right here. It is one of the crowd favorites that we have for you, but another crowd favorite is the next design I will show you. The XD135 Grenade OR. Now, the difference of this to the other ones, again, it's another crowd favorite, but aside from that though, this used to come from the XD Racing Series, but now it got moved to the OR Series. Ano ba yung OR? This is Off-Road Series. So it got some parts of the previous uh, racing design and they made it more off-road friendly. So it has the complete matte black finish here uh, along with the other designs. And of course, you guys should take a look at it. It is definitely a crowd favorite. But you know, we have another item here which could be another crowd favorite. But again, it's something pretty new and it's something we're gonna show you right now. And this is our last design of the series. This is known as the KM541 or also known as the Dirty Harry. As you can see, 
it's got the textured black to it and the spokes are designed differently. There is a circular design to these spokes and you know one of the cool things about this is that it is one of the newest releases we have. It's not yet on the website along with some of the other things we had for you. So that's it for this video. So Trisha, pwede mo bang imbitahan ng ating mga manonood on where they could get the XD Series KMC wheel products? Ayan. Please do like Brand's official Facebook page, XD Series and KMC Wheels PH and follow your Instagram account, XD Series KMC Wheels to catch the latest happens. All right, thank you very much for being with us, Trisha. And of course, we hope you guys enjoyed our video for today. Now remember, visit all of our authorized dealers to see what we have for you for XD and KMC wheels. In the meantime, make sure you like our video, give it a like, comment below, and subscribe to our channel, and click on the bell for more of the notifications. Remember, do keep in touch, and hopefully you stay tuned in for more events and other things we have for you only here at Team Ride Max Philippines TV. See ya! Thank you.